Okay, I'm looking at the Elite Edge node. This is the one that I'm running, and I just wanted to show you a couple of things. Number one, if you go over here to Open Wallet, it shows you your wallet, and it's showing that I have a balance of 1.0625 T-Fuel in the wallet. This is the internal wallet associated with your Edge node, and this is where your T-Fuel rewards from the Edge Cash and the Edge Compute will be deposited sometime during the first week for the previous month's earnings. So right now it was zero until a couple of minutes ago where I sent this 1.0625 T-Fuel to this wallet address. And what I want to show you is up here you see that address right there well you've got to click on this little arrow here if you click on that it opens up the theta blockchain explorer to that address and what you can see here when you scroll down is it shows the address which is the wallet address for your edge node and you'll notice it shows that it's got 1.0625 T fuel in it. And if you scroll down a little bit further, it shows you the amount that you have staked to this edge node. So this wallet address, when you installed your edge node, this of course is the elite edge node from mainnet 3.0. It creates a wallet randomly that's associated with your edge node so when you go to this address it shows you whatever t fuel you have in that wallet and it also shows you what is staked to your edge node and then down here it shows that it received while well, the only two things that have occurred is it has uh, it shows the deposit of my 200,000 t fuel to stake it and then it shows the incoming transaction as the 1.0625 t-fuel okay another thing to show you here is the internal wallet if you wanted to be able to open it and uh, do something with it outside of the edge node for some reason uh, you would need to go up to the top here let me uh, click on info come down here to export wallet as key store click that pops up this uh, box to uh, ask you to create a password so I typed in the password I want it to create the key store with I click export key store and it's telling me that it has created the key store file and placed it in the downloads folder on my computer and so now I can go and open the wallet and here I am in that wallet that I uploaded using the Theta Web Wallet and the key store file that I exported for the Edge Node wallet and as you can see the amount of T fuel in the wallet is 1.065 now if I wanted to send that somewhere I would use the password that I used when I created the key store file to confirm the outbound transaction okay to sum it all up you're probably wondering why would i want to export a key store for the internal wallet from my edge node and the answer to that is because without that key store file which is an encrypted version of the private keys for that wallet if you had let a bunch of t fuel build up in that wallet and then somewhere down the road you decided not to run that edge node anymore and you uninstalled it you also removed your only way to get into that wallet to recover that t fuel that's sitting in that wallet because the private key to that wallet is within the edge node itself so until you do this process of exporting a key store file the only way that you can access that wallet and transfer t fuel out of it is you 
using the open wallet function within the edge node and the private keys for that wallet are stored internally to that edge node. So this is a way of essentially exporting the private keys to that edge node wallet so that you can access it outside of the edge node. Hopefully that makes sense. Well that's a wrap for this presentation so cue the music. If you enjoyed the video, then hit that thumbs up for me, and I'll see you in the next video.